What is up, YouTube? Blaze Lama here, and here we are back with some more uh, Code Heroes 2. Uh, here we are. It looks like we are actually at World 3, which I don't think we were last time around. Or, um, not World 3. Into, um, what are they called? Star System 3. I think that's new. So we're going to see how this goes. We are actually on World 3, too. I guess that also makes sense. Uh,. I did, I think, only log in one time since I last popped in again. I'm playing this super slow. I just kind of let the game kind of just do its thing. We're not really super active. So I think we're, technically speaking, already for another Ascension. Because I think we really realistically want to do one every every single run. But last time I kind of waited partially through it. So part of me wants to try to make it through this one and see if we can do it. Although, I don't know if I consider this fast or slow the way we're going right now. It seems like it's going relatively fast. Maybe not. 24 hours, though, we're going up over 400 zones. Again, with the way I play, as long as I hop on more and just kind of push it, we could probably make it to, make it through this. Um, I'm trying to debate it, like I said, if I want to go with a different build. I know last episode, a couple of you guys gave some thoughts. We may do something with it. I'm not really sure, though. Uh, but we have the 54 points. Um, again, we can definitely ascend here. Um, but I think I might try to go for one without it. We haven't even gotten, like, huge... Um, we haven't got like this count here. So like, if I'm not gonna do, if I'm not gonna, if I'm gonna ascend, it doesn't make sense to grab. But I kind of want to push further, so let's grab it. I think I left my automator the way it was, right? So huge click should be activating, right? We should keep this up relatively active. Oops. Yeah. So when we're buying, things should be cheaper. Cool. So let's start getting other nodes that might make sense to have. Um, not necessarily we're going to worry about blue nodes. We'll grab some if we can to make the build kind of work. But uh, those aren't the huge huge point I'm working towards. Definitely want to make sure we're spending nine minute points and maybe even grabbing some more. Um, can't really go wrong with that. But if we're looking to get away from haste or in the crit, I think getting crit chance in, in crit damage could be really huge again. Um, I like the thought of maybe building just like a maybe even a crit storm at some point and we just kind of kind of come in here and crit storm and you know consumes two point five energy five clicks until you run out of energy um we need to keep energy up that's for sure i don't know how long this thing's cooldown is i think it's the same cooldown as um normal the normal clicking but i'm not too sure uh, I think it used to be. I'm almost positive it used to be. But they definitely may have changed it. So I'm thinking there's haste upgrades to shoot out for. There's treasure just chance upgrades to shoot out for. Which I guess you couldn't go wrong. And eventually you get yourself set up. Also item reg um, reduction cost things that might be worth going for. Gold things to keep. Um, so aiming for gold I think is going to be a big a big goal here. For close to anything. Like really close. It doesn't make sense to not grab it. Like those, you know, they're nice and all, but are they what we want? Maybe. Maybe they are. I don't know. Getting to that wouldn't be bad, but four points isn't worth it. I do grab an automator if I go that route, though. Not a terrible thought. Um, I don't think the auto attack percent damage is realistically going to do a whole ton for us. It makes sense to probably grab these as well, even though I have most of the automator stuff. I still think we want to grab it. The music seems like abnormally loud right now. Is it louder this episode? A couple of my audio settings got changed. Yeah, it definitely is a lot louder. I apologize. That should be a lot better. Hopefully that wasn't too loud. And hopefully it's still not too loud. You know what? Just to be safe. I'd rather have a little too quiet than too loud. Uh, but that should be better. So we got some automator points now. Uh, I'm not really sure what my plan was with them, I'll be honest. I don't really know. Might as well just start buying everything again. Kind of working through all of the sections. Making sure I have everything. I think I was going down on this tree for some reason. I think I need, there's something down there I wanted. Uh, I am thinking about going for crit chance nodes. I think that might be a solid thought. Because if we can get some crit chance going off the bat we'll be in pretty good shape i think uh again not really going to care too much about getting the blues um unless we're going to actually add them to our build so uh, getting extra mana um i guess you can't go wrong with having 
extra mana so we get mana regen and then mana right here as well as there is a crit chance not too far from here with another mana regen um, right there. I don't really use clickable gold. I think realistically I would rather that. So if I skip that and go there and then kind of split off. Um, just kind of node hunting. Uh, next episode will probably definitely ascend. I should get through hopefully this this thing that we're in here. Um, killing Surge. Reduce the cooldown. I guess we're using Power Surge. Like, do I need it though? That's the thing. I don't think I do. I don't think I do. There's a lot of mana regen and total mana and some even energy. That actually would be really nice to get that energy. I'm trying to think of if I want to go out for that. I don't think I do. Not that I don't want big clicks. I think I'll take the automator point. We can shoot back off this direction and then pop up here and grab all this. Again, just kind of kind of note hunting. That's uh, I think what we should have did a little more last time. Uh, now that I understand it a bit better, um, obviously until I do it a couple times, I think it'll be a little a little new. But um, so we'll take the auto attack to go grab the chance. Again, not really the best thing in the world. Um, damage up a huge clicks. I wonder if it'd be worth. Pumping up huge clicks. Increase the duration of that as well. Big clicks and huge clicks boosting might not be a bad idea. You know what? It's two nodes. Let's just grab that. Uh, I think I'm going to do the same thing down here too. Grab this huge clicks node. Spend a couple points to get to it. Um, there is a crit damage not too far. There's a crit chance as well as a nice haste, which, you know, looks appetizing. We'll go grab that. Um, what else are we looking for? I think this is kind of what I'm supposed to do. And realistically, ascending might be the play. Uh, this does seem like it might be a little slow. Um, but also, I haven't really been paying attention to what it's buying. I don't think we're buying things <laughs> super efficiently either. But it's hard to manage that. I don't think you can do it. The old setup I used to have for my, my run build here. And again, I do think I kind of want to vary away. We might do one more ascension with, with a build similar to this. But part of me just wants to like really try out a... A click build or something with a crit. Sorry, a click build. Every every build's gonna click. But um, yeah, we can grab the damage. I only have five more points, so I'm being really kind of scared. So we can get out to that and get some more crit damage, and then we'd be set for another chance node. Not a bad idea. And I think that's gotta be the play actually. A little bit of big clicks, a little haste, can't go wrong. And the auto attack damage, I don't know how much that's going to actually contribute, but, you know. We get, oh, actually, we get to that now. Cool. I totally miscalculated. So, that puts us at a good spot. Realistically, ascending now might be a good idea. Um, I'm not going to say it's not going to be. You know what? I think we do it. Because we just got to this world. Let's just do it. Let's just kind of do it every, every star system. I don't think it's a bad idea. I was also told to get rid of my... Uh, my haste build, uh, my haste items because these don't actually work anymore and I don't know if that's true but I'm gonna trust the person uh, and I'm gonna do it uh, I'm going to feel really dumb if I was lied to and was trolled but I also don't want to leave things on oh, there's a three percent I leave things on if they're not gonna not gonna help mana regen I mean it's better than probably probably better than that weapon gold received gold received got a better one um, I don't have damage or monster gold. I think I'll keep the monster gold. I liked that there. Uh, and I got nothing else new. Sadly, that makes a whole lot of sense. So we'll sell off. And we'll ascend. Screw it. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. Transcending. Uh, I don't think we're looking to do that for a while. Uh, but yeah, let's see what happens. Yeah, let's do it. I don't know how much damage I'm going to get. Does it say how much I'm going to get in that tree? In here, does it say? Uh, setting will consume Starfire on all your world crumbs. Give you damage based on the number of world crumbs consumed. Your skill tree will be reset. So, I really wish it showed how much you're going to get more. More so. I, does it show in here how many world crumbs I have? World crumbs. Okay. So it seems like I've got a lot. Let's just do it. 
I don't remember how many we had the first time. Okay. You descend your base damage. Uh, our ba I mean, you can see we're already doing a lot more damage. It seems like with no abilities, we're, we're going to probably beat this. So it definitely was worth it. Your base damage has been multiplied by a very large number. Almost 40 thousand percent your skills has been reset cool let me get our one our one point which we can build kind of where we want i'm i'm nervous to not do my haste build i really am just because i'm so used to it part of me is definitely nervous to try something else and i don't necessarily know if i want to go off even a build that you guys gave me or if i just kind of want to do my own thing part of me says rush crit storm how bad could it be? But we've also, this Transcendence, we've also been kind of setting up for for this build. So I don't know if, like, per Transcendence, I should kind of try to focus a build. Because, like, swapping at mid-time, having haste, doing something else. Yeah, you know what? Maybe we'll stick with our build till we Transcend, which I honestly don't know when that will be. Um, I don't know when our first Transcendence is supposed to happen. But, uh, you know, obviously, it'll it'll come. It'll come. So that's kind of what we're waiting for, but I think that was probably smart. I mean, it definitely, we're doing more damage to these bosses. Whether we're going to progress faster elsewhere, I don't know. I'm assuming we probably will. Um, and again, when I come back, all of a sudden I'll have a, have a ton of stuff going on. We definitely want that, sure. And whatever, I'll grab the, oh, did I not buy that? Cool. So we got another, um, it actually let me buy two, yeah. So another moment. So we'll get, here souls, we're going to get 32, which I don't think is going to be enough. I mean, this costs five alone. For example, if I wanted the gold or seed, it's gonna cost five. Um, it increases at five five percent, so or not five percent, uh, like a very small number. Like you can see there, it's literally almost half a percent. Um, this one's well half, yeah. Half, okay, yeah, man, they increase so little. A lot of these are just so little. I feel like you need so many um, hero souls before you transcend. I don't actually like know the golden number I'm looking for. Um, I'm not too positive, but obviously this seems way too early to be looking to do that. Um, hopefully we'll get through quite a few worlds, but I think we gotta kind of stick to this haste build we've got, just because until we transcend, we're gonna have the kind of the bonus and you know doing it the way we've been doing it. Um, you know, getting you know the mana doesn't really make a difference, but. So we've been doing it. We've been buying a lot of haste nodes over and over. Like, I think I think that's gonna be just kind of the way it goes. Um, I don't think it'd be too smart just to, to swap it. Because again, when you buy any gray or gold nodes, you like get a portion of them back as you level, something like that. It's a little confusing because it's not directly the same amount that they give, but it's like a portion of what they seem to give. Um, or maybe it is even all of it. It's just because I have no nothing really going for me. It doesn't seem like a lot. Like, what's my haste at right now? Yeah, I mean, it's only three. Uh, a lot more. A lot of our haste does come from like killing frenzy and whatnot. But what we have a bit over base stats. Like, um, I don't even think you start with crit damage or crit chance. Actually, I think you have like no crit chance off the off the bat, which we have a very small amount. Um, but. Yeah, I'm definitely definitely interested to transcend. I just don't think it'll happen for probably still a while longer. Um, now that you get down here, some of these just cost a ridiculous amount. Um, cause auto attacks. It's going more powerful with Curse of Juggernaut. So you could probably get some crazy Curse of Juggernaut build going um, down the line. But at the get go, it's it's going to be building around you know these guys where they cost cost five, and I feel like buying one is not going to be enough. Um, and I don't know what build I want to prep for when I do transcend. I'm not really sure. Um, going for the whole like big click setup with with this setup isn't bad. And again, we nonetheless some of the builds are going to go down in this this bottom part of the tree anyways, because you're still going to want big clicks a lot of the time. You know, we probably want honestly big boost big clicks, or maybe even moving them to small clicks, I should say. And um, rocking with crit storm, like so, mixing and matching might not be terrible, and I could probably get away with still going up and grabbing it. It's just I haven't built enough crit. I feel like to start all of a sudden jumping into that that side of the the tree. Uh, and again, I really don't know what I'm talking about, so that's just me 
completely bullshitting and saying what seems like it might make sense. I don't like think the like, picking up these would make much sense. I, I don't think we're gonna be looking to pick up anything that boosts a specific weapon slot at all. I mean, the treasure chest chance. I feel like you're more looking for damage, if anything, when you first do it, though. Item reduction cost, like, and it's per node you buy, so like it adds up. But click damage. I doubt that's gonna do a whole ton for you. I just feel the most comfortable with haste. It's pretty bad. I mean, I could definitely, definitely, would feel somewhat comfortable diving into a crit build, and that might be the play. It might be to try to like stack these two. My first. uh Transcendence. Stack these two and maybe even if I, I mean depending on how much I have, maybe even some gold or even some treasure chest chance or something. Monster gold, like anything. Um, maybe boosting those nodes would not be a bad idea. Uh, and even maybe putting five in a haste node, depending on how many we, we come out with here. We're only at thirty two. I don't know what we're looking for, but hopefully we'll see soon. Um, probably gonna expect a little bit more of a jump between this episode and next episode. Um, I'm probably gonna log on a couple times instead of just logging in like once or twice um kind of get us going a little bit more uh maybe i'll even pop in give you like a quick build update i'll spend the even maybe spend the points with you guys and then i'll come back and uh kind of just do a little bit more jumping around uh, rather than what we're doing now but uh anyways if you guys enjoyed the video please take a second smack that like button and as always i'll see you in the next one